Hi, it's Allison. I've been a math teacher for 15 years, and today I want to talk to you about slope. Now, slope is the measure of how much a line inclines or declines away from the horizontal. So let's talk a little bit more about how to find slope. Often slope is denoted by the letter m, so we'll use that for now. It requires two points to determine slope. You have to have two sets of coordinates, an x1 and a y1, and an x2 and a y2. Now, here's how you find the slope of a line. Let's say we have two points. Let's say we have the point 2 minus 5 and the point 3 and 1. Now, slope is rise over run. It's the difference in the y-coordinates over the difference in the x-coordinates. So let's try it with the points we have here and see what happens. So I'm going to take one of my y-coordinates, I'm going to take the 1, let's say, and then I'm going to subtract, it, subtract from it the other y-coordinate, the minus 5. So 1 minus negative 5. And that's going to be over the difference in the x-coordinates. Now, since this was the y-coordinate I picked first, I need to make sure I put this x-coordinate first on the bottom. Otherwise, my slope will have the wrong sign. So on the bottom, I'm going to put a 3, and I'm going to subtract from it this x-coordinate over here, this 2. Okay, so 1 minus negative 5 is the same as 1 plus 5. 1 plus 5 is 6. And 3 minus 2 is 1. And 6 over 1, we can just rewrite as 6. So the line that joins the points 2, 5, I'm sorry, 2, negative 5, and 3, 1, will have a slope of 6. Now, you can actually tell if a slope is positive or negative just by looking at a graph of the line. If you have a line that slopes up from left to right, that has a positive slope. And if you see a line that goes down from left to right, that line has a negative slope. And that's slope. Thanks for learning with me today. If you'd like more information on any of the topics, click on the links below. And be sure to rate, comment, or subscribe to our channel. If you have a specific request, please send it to requests at mahalo.com. I'll see you next time.